Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. And one of my viewers or subscriber asked me if I'd ever done a video on the revert, which is under the file section right there, revert. And the, the I guess the purpose of the of the deal of the revert, instead of going through here and going back up and, and like we showed yesterday where you could back up in the history. Well, let's just do that. Let's bring out the history again, Docker's history. And I can revert to where the, the file was at the beginning, right there. And then I can, you know, I, I took away all my steps I just did. And then if I want to go back, but I don't really see the reason for the revert because I've got this saved. If I cancel this out and just say, I don't want to save the changes, then I can go to file and open and just go to that file and open back up and it's it brings up the file that I had when I started. So if you made a bunch of changes, let's say we deleted that, we're gonna select that, hold down the shift key and put a rectangle around it. We're gonna draw a rectangle, you know, draw a bunch of rectangles, draw some ellipses, you know, do some other work, maybe delete this and you go, well, I messed up. I didn't need, mean to do that. You can go right here to file to revert. And it's going to ask you, do you want to go back to the original file? And there it is. So it's a little bit quicker than canceling out and reopening it. And uh, it could be pretty useful. I could see that, that part when you go, well, I made so many changes. I want to just start over. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.